So the small titanium screw developed in the early 1960s went into dental implants and then into walking. We started to see things are happening with body image, perception, etc. You can start to, with the feedback from the osteoperception, you can utilize your prosthesis for more advanced activities. And now we're starting to more actively talk to and with the brain so that the prosthesis can be perceived as not the prosthesis, but the part of your own body. But we need to continue to develop ways of interacting with the brain without directly needing to uh, decode the brain signal. And it has to be natural, so with little mental effort. There are a lot of fantastic things we can do together in the future. Thank you.